How do we use bath powder to polish our bodies? If you want others to be envious of your skin, use natural cosmetics rather than synthetic soaps. This post will teach you how to make such powder. Required things beetroot juice, rice flour, cardamom, tomato powder, multanai matty, avarampu, red sandalwood powder. What are the benefits of bath powder making products? Beetroot skin benefits Beetroot contains vitamin C, which protects the skin from the signs of premature aging. Beetroot is excellent for hydrating your skin and aiding in the treatment of itchy skin patches. Beetroot juice provides a quick fix for dark circles, spots, and blemishes. Beets contain vitamin C, which aids in the reduction of melanin formation, resulting in hyperpigmentation. A glass of beetroot juice helps to maintain skin elasticity, which aids in wrinkle prevention. With its natural nutrients, beetroot juice helps to reduce excessive pigmentation while also revitalizing the skin. Natural ingredients for nourishing our skin cells. If your complexion is dull and lifeless due to dry, rough skin, red sandalwood can help. Blotchy skin with a lot of blemishes and old breakout marks is extremely unappealing. Choose red sandalwood for a perfectly even tone. Red sandalwood can be extremely beneficial in exfoliating the upper dead skin cell layer and revealing a new layer of skin beneath. Red sandalwood powder can absorb excess oil and reduce sebum secretion in your skin, keeping it greasy-free throughout the day. It not only fades those unsightly tan lines, but it also protects the skin from future sun damage. Tomato powder, tomato exfoliates the skin gently by removing the top layer of dead skin cells. Tomato contains deep cleansing agents and, as previously stated, corrects the pH levels of the skin, allowing it to effectively prevent breakouts and reduce acne. Tomatoes are high in vitamin C, E, and beta-carotene, which can help to even out skin tone, brighten it, and reveal its natural complexion. Tomatoes are high in vitamin B complexes, which aid in the prevention of early signs of aging. Tomato works as a natural astringent, shrinking pores and reducing breakouts. Tomatoes contain anti-inflammatory compounds that help to soothe and calm the skin. Cardamom Cardamom has antiseptic and anti-inflammatory properties that can soothe and calm your skin. Elaichi, also known as green cardamom, has antibacterial properties that help fight skin allergies while also making your skin clear and smooth. This cardamom is used to achieve radiant skin. Cardamom oil is an effective treatment for aging signs such as wrinkles and fine lines. Multani Midi, Multani Midi cleans and absorbs excess oil. Removing sweat, impurities, and dead skin cells, removing blackheads and whiteheads, controlling excess oil production, shrinking the appearance of pores, cooling the skin, and soothing inflammation-induced irritation. Multani Midi contains ions that lighten the skin and heal sun damage. Avarampu, Senoriculata, Avarampu lightens scars and blemishes when used as a bath powder or a face pack. However, we must use it on a regular basis in order to see results. Avarampu also aids in the removal of suntan and protects our skin. It is extremely gentle on the skin and is suitable for all skin types. Avarampu is also commonly found in baby bath powder. Rice flour, rice is high in antioxidants. These antioxidants counteract the harmful compound elastics, which causes premature aging. The use of rice flour face packs tightens and tones the skin. As a result, it balances the oil levels and provides a matte finish. Rice can also help to maintain and repair the skin's natural barrier. It also shields it from pollution and free radicals. Bath powder making methods, grind the beetroot and squeeze the juice. Take 4 tablespoons of the beetroot juice and soak 3 cardamoms in it. Then take a cup of rice flour. Mix 2 tablespoons of tomato powder, 2 tablespoons of avarampu, 2 tablespoons of multani mati fuller's earth, and 2 tablespoons of red sandalwood powder. Put the beetroot and soaked cardamom in a mixing jar and grind well. Then put the prepared powder in it and grind. It will be in the form of flour to look at. How can this bath powder be used while bathing? Take a small amount of this bath powder and mix it with yogurt and soak for 10 minutes. Then rub it on the body and leave for a while. It should be bath after a while. Tips for using this powder. For those with oily skin, soak a little yogurt in this powder and take a bath to cure skin diseases quickly. People with dry faces will get the benefit more quickly if they use a mixture of milk and honey. This powder can be used along with rice flour. Mogdal flour, Senoriculata flour, turmeric, and other essential herbs. 
Benefits of this bath powder, heals facial scars, pigmentation, blackheads, oily skin, sunburn, and dry skin. This powder not only helps in bathing but also as a scrubber and face pack. This powder can use by both men and women. If the remaining beetroot juice is stored in the refrigerator and rubbed on the lips, the dark lips will turn into pink lips. The bleaching properties in beetroot make it the most wanted ingredient in a lip balm. It not only promotes lightening of the lip color, but beetroot also nourishes the lips and helps in retaining moisture. You can use this bath powder instead of soap. It contains only natural herbs and does not cause any side effects. This one bath powder is the solution to all the skin problems on the face. How to make up for bath powder shortcomings There is a slight delay in taking a bath using this powder. These are the drawbacks of this powder. But since it does not contain any chemicals, it can cure all skin diseases without harming the skin. There is no need to soak bath powder in our body for too long. This means that you can get the full benefit of this powder by scrubbing it well all over the body. Do not bathe with soap after applying this bath powder to the body. You can use this bath powder after bathing with soap. This bath powder can cause allergies in children for some time. Therefore it is better not to use it if there are any variations in the body or you can use both mung dal flour and chickpea flour instead of this powder. Put the soap away and just try using this.